guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to go shopping with my mom. We are going to Joann's, Michael's, Hobby Lobby, maybe a few other stores. I'm not quite sure yet to see how much time we have. I don't know before I have to go pick up my kids from school. But I am looking for something for my kitchen and maybe my front porch. So let's just head on in and see what we can find. Look out, here she comes The woman that I love It's too bad she'll never know Yeah, I can't tell her how I feel Because she has someone who makes her happy I'm a ghost in these walls Or at least I try to be I hope that I'm not showing how I feel for her, but she won't feel the same for me. I've got this picture in my mind, it's just the two of us, just the two of us, but I know I'll have to try, try to let her go, because she won't. 
I listen when she talks. I watch her when she walks. She's given me these feelings that I've never felt before. But she will never know that I love her so well. She's with somebody else, and I will have to let her go. She will never know, na na, never know, na na. She will never know, na na, never know, na na. She'll never know. It's like she stole my heart without knowing she did. But I guess that it will pass. Yeah, I can't be the only one who got lost inside the blue of those eyes. I've gotta let her go. I know it won't be easy. I wanna hold her close, but I have to try, try as hard as I can, 'cause she'll never be mine. So I just wanted to quickly show you what my mom got. All right. That was 80% off and it was normally $80. $80 and how much was it? 15, 15, 15. And then she got these super adorable Be Our Guest signs. And it was buy one, get one free. And she's gonna put these in her guest room. And they were $50 each. These were from Michael's. Okay, so I just got back from the store, and I'm going to show you everything that I got so far. I do plan on going to Hobby Lobby still, but I'm not going to have time before, I'm not going to have time to go before I pick up Mateo, because I got to leave here in a few minutes. So first I'm going to show you what I got at um, Marshall's. So I ended up getting that really adorable Buffalo Check pumpkin, and it was only $6.99. I got this one. It is called Sweet Apple. Crisp Sweet Apple with hints of juicy fresh pear and it's a DW Home candle. These ones always smell really, really good and it was only $6.99. I love the color of the glass and I just thought it was really pretty and it smelled really, really good. And then the other thing at Marshall's is I got a new fan because the pink one that I had on my bedside table broke. It just stopped working. And this one was only $20, and this one's white. Exactly like my other one, but white. My other one was pink. 
now I'm going to show you what I picked up at Michael's. I just got this. It's just a wood. It's just this wooden plank. I don't even know what you would call it. It's just a wood piece. And on the back, it has these hooks here to where you can hang it on the wall. You can either hang it vertically or horizontally. And it was normally $15, but it was on sale. And I think I only paid $3 for this. And I do have a project idea using some Dollar Tree items and something from Target Dollar Spot and that will probably be another video, but I'm really excited to show you what I make out of this. And the other thing at Michael's, I bought these fall leaves. And I really wanted to try and stay with really neutral colors in my kitchen. So I will probably use these in my kitchen somewhere. And then the other thing that I got at Michael's was this adorable sign. And it says pumpkin spice everything so cute and I'm going to hang it in my kitchen somewhere. I don't know where. It might be right above my stove. I'm not sure. And this was um, part of their sale. They Their fall items right now or I can't talk. Their fall items right now are buy one get one free. At Joann's I only got one thing. They did have a ton of cute things in there but I only ended up getting one thing and it was this bundle right here and they are these really pretty pink and cream colored flowers these were part of their fall collection called blooming autumn and it was $14.99 but i got it for like eight dollars and change because it was 50 percent off i will probably make something out of this and these leaves right here so that is everything that i purchased so far today and I do plan on going to Hobby Lobby. Hopefully I can get around to going to Hobby Lobby as well. And um, I will bring you along with me if I do. Maybe he'll Okay, so I am back home and I just got back from Hobby Lobby and I'm going to show you everything that I got there and I got three of these little glass knobs and after I show you everything that I got there, I'm going to show you what I am using these for. So I got three of these and they were $3.99 a piece and they were 50% off. Okay, so now that I have everything out of the bags, I'm just going to quickly show you everything that I purchased. So I found this adorable wooden fall sign. I thought this was so incredibly pretty. So all their fall right now is 40% off. This was $15.99 regular priced and then it was 40% off. I just got like this little swag. It's like a grapevine, a dried grapevine um, wreath type thing. It was $3.99 and I got 40% off of that because I used my 40% off coupon. But what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to make another swag that goes right over my clock above my mantle. And this is exactly what I used for my last one. I did make a video on that and I do plan on making another video. So I'm just going to make one for fall. I got these um, picks right here. These were... $4.99 and 40% off. 
And then I got a white pumpkin. I got two of these and they were $2.99 regular priced and they were 40% off. And then I got this thankful sign and it was regular priced $5.99, 40% off $5.99. And I'm going to style my little tear tray and I'm going to use this in there and I'll probably add some pumpkins. And then I got just one of these. I thought this was so adorable. And this was 40% off at $9.99. I got one of those. And then I got this little bundle of pumpkins and some pine cones and they're like the velvet pumpkins. There's some cream colored ones in there and some gray. And I thought they were so cute. $7.99, 40% off of that. And then I got this other little bundle of pumpkins. The fabric is, I want to say it's like a flannel type fabric. And then the other one is just a uh, plastic. And then I got these small little pumpkins here for $7.99, 40% off of that. And they're just like that velvety fabric. And then the last thing that I got were these pretty leaves right here. And I'm going to make some type of arrangement in those right there. Don't mind my house, it's a mess. So I'm gonna make some fall pieces to go right here and I wanted something to kind of hang down and that's what I'm gonna use these for. And this was $15.99, 40% off. So that is everything that I purchased from Hobby Lobby, Michaels, Joann's, and Marshalls. Okay, so um, a while back in a previous video when I styled my kitchen hut and I mentioned in my video that I did not really care for the stems. So this is what I ended up doing for the stem. I took a cute little glass knob that I purchased at Hobby Lobby and I just stuck it in place where the stem was. I mean you could just pull these out really easy and then just um, take the knob and then just kind of push it down in there and there you go a cute little top. So now I'm just going to quickly show you how to make a arrangement that goes on the wall and I am just using this chicken wired wall pocket decor piece. I picked that up at Hobby Lobby during the springtime I believe and I like to decorate these seasonally. So for the spring and summer I will keep the same one up and then I will switch it out for fall and then I will switch it out again for Christmas and then I'll go back to spring and it's different every single season because I like different things all the time as you can tell. So I had some Spanish moss in there and I picked that up at, I want to say Walmart. It was really cheap for the bag. I want to say it was like $3 for a really big bag and that had enough to make two. So I'm going to pack that back up and put it in with my spring and summer items so I can use it again next year. And then I am just clipping off all the pieces of these um, floral bushes really quickly and then clipping the vine part off of the leaves. And then I have this little bundle of raffia that I picked up at the Dollar Tree and I split it in half and then I just kind of stuck that in the basket just to hide some of the stems. And then I'm just placing the greenery in first and then I'm going in with the flowers. And I like to do um, my flowers in threes. Um, I guess it just looks better to the eye when you do do it that way. I did work in a floral shop and that's what they did teach me. So that's what I'm doing right here and it seriously only took me like five minutes to do. You can take more time and you can add as much or as little as you like. And um, I just loved the way the leaves kind of hung over and it ended up looking. I was very happy with it. Everything but now. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, I would love it if you left me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you are new and I hope you guys all have an amazing day. Bye.